G'day fellas and welcome back to the Daniel Monroe RTG. Now the very first thing I have to say before anything else, this is the first video I'm recording in the brand new apartment. I've had to change my setup a little bit so it looks completely different to what it used to. I guess what I'm trying to say is if the green screen is like a little messed up or something like that, I apologize and I will be trying to fix it. But as of right at this second, I don't know because I haven't tried it before. But anyway. Today we actually finish the regular season. We have Kentucky, rank six Mississippi, and Texas A&M. And in training, I kind of lost the first stream. So we're no longer the starter, but it shouldn't be an issue because we're gonna get that right back anyway. Anyway, fellas, if you're new around here and you enjoy Madden and NCAA content, this is the channel for you. Don't forget to sub. All my socials are down in the didgeridoo. And if you'd like to pick yourself up some G Fuel discount code CROW at checkout, my referral link is the top one in the description. That being said, fellas, let's get into it. Do you think they have kind of an unfair advantage blending in with the snow? Like that nobody realized that but me? Maybe? Bit of a mismatch? Like right here? Take that, Daniel Monroe with a nice little catch. All right, Kentucky got to come back and score one on us. We got to find a way to break away in this game. Damn, look at that pancake. Let's go, baby. Why aren't we being utilized? I did the kick return and then we never came on for the rest of the drive. Get that block on the left, please. Ah, dang it. We still don't outspeed like anybody. Dot. Let's go. And we broke. No. We full broke the tackle there and everything. This is a touchdown. 1,000% this is a touchdown. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Right in the back corner. Daniel Monroe. Oh, my goodness. We hit it with a 360 no scope. Right in the. That's beautiful. Madden could never. Oh, I nearly stole his catch. Okay. And we got this crappy little round. I'm going to go change it to a drag. Oh, they go in the back corner. It's another touchdown. 28 to 7, Missouri. Back corner again. It's number 15, bro. They cannot stop him, literally. That's his second touchdown of the day. I'm so proud of our boys. It seemed like only an episode ago that no matter what we did, we would lose 40 to 7. And here we are without me doing anything and we're up like 35 to 17. For real, quarterback, I'm going to need a throw though. I need, I need you to throw it to me one time. My hands are literally getting frozen out here doing nothing. There we are. Oh, we dropped it. Okay, so now this is like super sketchy because it's 38-31 and there's one minute left and they have timeouts? No, no, no. This this has to stop right now. Good block by me, by the way. If we get the first down here, I'm almost certain that we just win. Like the game is just over. You can do a round tree. We all believe in you, mate. Come on, blocking for a minute. Okay, there we go. Whew, okay. I just really wanted to win that game so we could go to a bowl game. That's all, man. Okay, so unfortunately, I have not been able to get our first string spot back yet. But one thing you will notice, that's a lot of XP right there. I have not seen the skill upgrades. We are going to do this together, fellas. We got no Really? I thought there would at least be one ability we could buy. But these are all one game boosts, etc. On second thought, we might have a chance in this game. But regardless of what happens next week, we should get an opportunity to maybe even get a 12,000 point boost. So fellas, I will reiterate, no like goal. But if you do enjoy the Daniel Monroe RTG, don't forget to leave a like. Literally takes a second and it helps out the channel so, so much. I would greatly appreciate it, fellas. Now let's jump into it. Oh, this reminds me of the Deontay Rose RTG. Let me know if you remember that. Well, it was one of the most successful things on the channel, so. There we go. Nice pancake. I'm up the sideline. Swerve on him. No. We got injured on the very... Okay, it took long enough, but we are finally back. And we're already at halftime, pretty much. And we got the lead as well. Let's go, man. Oh, I blocked the snow. That's fine. There we go. And I broke the tackle. Bro, it made me run to the right though. I was trying to cut up. I don't know what happened, but we just punted them the ball and instantly got the ball back. 
I'm not complaining about it though. I'm looking to run it up on rank four Ole Miss. Could you imagine? Like, we're beating these guys right now. We could win this game. I hope there's an upgrade that's just like 10 to speed. That would be the best. That would be exactly what we need. I was wide open. He threw it to me, but it got batted up. And I get punished for that? Because his pass got batted up. I get punished. Dot him. There we go. Finally, we're getting involved as we take the biggest hit in college football history. Huge right here, though. If we can find a way to score, then we 100% win this game. There's no way they come back. Come on, man. Hang on to him for more than half a second. He's a bit trigger happy, our quarterback, ain't he? We can secure the bag right here. Absolutely. With two minutes left. Nice pancake. Look at that pancake up on the sideline. Let's go. Dang, we get good field position though. That was their last time out right there. We would have to mess this up royally to not win this game. The fact that we're not like really running out the clock is a big problem. Like we got 30 seconds to burn, mate, and you're gonna snap it in five. Hit me. Oh, don't hit me, don't hit me. Quarterback's taken off. He stiff armed. He fumbled it. Bro, he did. Thank you, quarterback, for uh, taking off randomly when, you know, all you had to do was run the clock out. We won the game, but, you know, it's all right. Don't worry about it. We didn't want to beat rank four Ole Miss anyway. <laughs> like. Oh, my God, it's Daniel Monroe. Let's go, baby. Please. Breaks the tackle. Gets us straight back into field goal range. I think we got injured again, so I'm going to watch this. But we need a touchdown here. We deserve to win. We rushed it. Who is our head coach, man? Okay, we're taking a field goal to go to overtime. Oh, in the snow and everything. This would be a really hard kick. It's up. It's good, 30 off. So on their drive, they only come away with a field goal, which means that all we need is to get a touchdown. After that, we're Gucci. You just need a touchdown. Come on, big run by Roundtree to, no, it wasn't. I really want to be the one to score this touchdown. Like, if this, just give it to me. Come on. Just give me, give me, give me. In the back corner. Oh my goodness. Daniel Monroe, we did it. They're going to bring that back though. Like a thousand percent, they're going to bring that back. There's no... Play of the game, obviously, is going to be the catch in OT. I guess we did get our foot down. Yeah, I didn't even see that. My mind was just racing right there. So we only had three catches for 29 yards, but we had the game-winning touchdown. And we're only 155 points away from getting to 12K. Yo, we got ranked with three losses, though? We got ranked? Okay. The only one that we can get is let's do this. This is actually really, really good because it's going to give us three agility and two release. Our release is so bad. If I didn't take this, there would be something wrong with me, mate. So we still keep 8,000 points, which is really solid. We can use that in the next episode. But for now, this is going to be the last game of this episode and the last game of the regular season. So next episode, we're going to play our first bowl game, see everything that's going on with the team, and we're going to play the first game of our sophomore season as well. So next episode is going to be dope. For now, let's finish out strong against the Aggies, mate. Okay, this is it, fellas. We are 2-0 and o on the day. Let's make it 3-0. Nice little block. Texas A&M has no nothing for us. Oh, man. I'm just... I'm so overwhelmed right now. It's ridiculous. It's a really cool feeling. Oh, how did we catch that, though? What? I'm going to turn this into, like, a drag or a slant, for example. But I'm not running this route. What a waste of time. See? And I'm making plays out there for the squad. We're going to score a touchdown right here. Hopefully. That presses to yes, I'm wide open. Throw it. You what? That was the okay. We get a punt return. Let's see if we can turn this game around. Their offense is so crap, they couldn't do anything in like three attempts. So let's see if we can at least. 
Help out our team. Let's go, Monray. I'm going full, full sweaty try-hard mode right now. Well, I talked crap, and now they're up 21 to 7. So it seems like I cannot catch a break today. <laughs> okay, there's more than enough time for us to get into it here. We're literally on the cusp of the red zone, and there's two minutes left. There's no way we don't score here, right? Cut back. Oh, quarterback wants to take off again. That's cool. That's cool. Just don't fight. We scored! Let's go, man! And we get 50 seconds to potentially score again. Wide open, wide open. What a catch up break! The double tackle step action! Woo -hoo -hoo. Let's go, baby! No! How do we get the entire length of the field? Bro, we broke two tackles. Hit him with the step back cheese, then hit him with a swerve cheese, come back, and then we just can't break the last one. But if we score here. That you can thank Daniel Monroe for that touchdown right there. He threw a pick. Ah, that's tough. Like, he's playing really well in some aspects, but he's also completely selling the game. Lucky for us, Texas A&M's offense is actually not that good. <laughs> Otherwise, we'd be down 45 to 21. So if this game already wasn't like super weird to begin with, we got a safety? We're kind of losing yards, but we keep going back to the same plays. Like, I guess try the dive again if you're that confident in it. I can't say zero yards. We're doing a quarterback blast. Oh my god, bro, you didn't get it? That's so cringe. But like for real though, we have to start getting this offense in gear. They're pressing. What can we do? Go wide open. I'm wide open. There we go. Making plays. All right, here we go. Second and seven. One minute left. The routes are looking kind of trash, but that's okay. We can deal with this. I can't even get off the press. He took off. Why is he running the ball? He's selling the game. Quarterback is going to make me pull out my hair, bro. Some of his decision making is just the worst. I'm wide open, by the way. Literally wide open, Mr. Clutch coming in super clutch again. Pike the pike the ball. Oh wait, we were only down by one anyway. All we had to do was kick a field goal. <laughs> oh man, I just wanted to win like three games in a row so bad. And that's how we're gonna finish off the episode. We had eight catches for 169 yards. I feel like that's probably our career high right there. No touchdowns, but we definitely contributed by far the most. With that being said, fellas, if you enjoyed this episode of the RTG, don't forget to leave a like. If you made it this far into the video, you are the real MVP. Please stay safe. Hope the rest of your day is awesome. And from me personally, I'm out. Peace. Hey, you love to talk, I don't talk, I get it. Yeah, you know I'm about to dip kill me, I'm a let it. Run into the bag like I'm so athletic. I've been up since six, making hits like tennis. I've been on fire, I just need my credit. Wanna go far, need to change my settings. Reaching for the stars on so my feet, touch heaven. I've been head first, bitch.